Okay. Uh, let's continue in honor of Sergei Ruski, Paruski, Sergei Brin, Paruski, Paruski. Ruski in America uh, with his partner uh, Larry Page uh, make his own rules in America. What a wonderful country. Uh, let me demonstrate you now in America how it is done. This is from Google. This is Blogger platform. Same as YouTube owners of Sergey Brin, Larry Page, Americanski, Americanski Paruski partnership. And tell me about the war in Ukraine. Okay, let's go and we're going to see how they envision this stuff. I'm using uh, what is Oprah browser. This is an Oprah browser. Yeah. And first thing, I cannot access my own blog. I cannot access the blog. Uh, I am blocked from accessing blog. Uh, it's called the Outset Times. I understand and we should could to continue basically is what I am prompted like this, like an imbecile, like this. And you, you continue to click and click, click. And you cannot even, as a result, because this is my blog, I don't even have a capacity to copy my own links from the blog. How difficult this make things? Um, it makes difficult. You, as an average viewer, might not even see uh, anything like this when going through my blog. Uh, however, there are certain posts on my blog uh, to which Ruskis uh, and Americanski partner are very sensitive now and will not allow them uh, you to see them. Yeah, there are certain posts that will use exactly this system to you, average viewer, to block you from viewing. As for myself, as the owner of the blog, uh, probably that's you know, if I go to the Microsoft Edge, um, let's see what's going to happen. This is the address I am going to take. This is the address for, from the blog. It looks like this. So this is also to be used as a criminal evidence for those that are investigating this case. You now home, click here to browse. Yeah, this is where all the links should display. Yeah, and I get prompted again for Amerikanski, Paruski. I understand, says Putin. Joe Biden will say, I understand, I wish to continue. Click here to go on with it. Yeah, this is now what we are dealing with. This is how now, this is not the journalism. This is a police work I do. I am collecting the criminal evidence here. I am collecting the criminal evidence for police to have not enforced their jobs as required to by the laws, by the constitution as they required, Federal Bureau investigation failed. Justice Department failed. So I am, instead of them, collecting the evidence so that I could submit one to the law enforcement. Is it something wrong with the law enforcement? Is it like against the law for the law enforcement to exist? Is it for the courts? Talking to the British royals right now, maybe to the hooligan that is chasing his own ass in United States of America. A royal hooligan, Prince Harry, to you I'm talking about. You who have a case at a British court and you have to prove that you need additional money for your own security, for your own well-being, for your hooliganism. You who are trying to prove crime against yourself with your daddy now King Charlie and your brother King uh, Prince William that indeed you are entitled to the money for the security that's how you screw the world with bullshit this is how you cluster fuck the media this is how you cluster fuck people that's how you get attention basically Talking to you, 
with the special needs? Is it something wrong with the law? Is it something wrong with the Supreme Court? I'm asking because you're in the United States of America right now. So this is now my case. This is basically how this stuff works. This is how the corruption, criminality, British corruption, criminality in London, Saxe Coburg got on our advanced, Romanov's advanced now, also through United States of America. This is basically, this is the issues we have going on here. So I have to use another browser. I'm not logged in. Or I can, for the demonstration purposes, go back to the Oprah. Uh, this here, for information, was uh, Microsoft Edge. Every time when I'm going to, you see, close Microsoft Edge. Every time when I'm going to have to go through this stuff like this, I'm going to kick your ass. So just that you know, I'm going to kick your boss, actually. No, no, I am not going to be using Firefox. I, I, I better, it, it, it's more effective if I actually log myself out and then do the same thing, right? That would make more sense. So still, even if you're average viewer, there are certain links you cannot access. So what we're going to do is I'm going to log myself out here. If those are not convenient for the Saxe Coburg Gotha. Oh, look, something went wrong. Refresh. Okay. Uh, what we're going to do is let's go to this one here and we're going to try to enter that to see whether I can somehow access this. And if I click here until, because I don't want to log myself from all the accounts that I have in this browser in honor of. Oh, it, I have to use another browser. It's going to be easy. No, so Firefox browser, which I'm not logged in. Yes, Prince Harry has a big case right now. He's got a case with... It's a British court. He is inquiring about more safety. He, he sued the British state. Uh, they did him injustice. It's a terrible thing. And all of a sudden, it's a paparazzi that is uh, chasing with a paparazzi. And I'm sure as a James Bond, because he is a good driver, uh, things for him are just coming along uh, for him, according to his extraordinary capabilities James Bond capabilities maybe he got them in Afghanistan where he killed 25 uh, Al-Qaeda warriors okay so it's taking some time now to access the blog that's interesting the signal is a fairly good signal Signal was reduced. Signal is really strong. Now I changed the area to be right under the router. I'm going to go and I'm going to click here. This goes under the quality of the blog service itself. Folks. So if you're a blogger and you should be getting a faster response, it should work faster. According to the websites from the past, which I have used to test the quality of the blogger, it was fairly okay when compared to other uh, blog uh, services platforms. It was the response was fairly okay, but it, it looks like it's kind of slow. They're looking up bitmonet.com. You know, who the fuck is the bitmonet? And then just static and pa, geo, la, pieces, whatever. Oh, opozorilo v o občutljivi u Sabini in Slovenian language is very sensitive content and you have to acknowledge that you understand and now you get to uh, basically uh, there you go, razumem in želim, I understand and I do like to proceed, alright, I like to continue, okay, so now let's see what else do we have, what else are they loaded I like the idea about this stuff because I did manage to now re-record all this stuff. 
from Bitmonet to whatever. So let's see what else. Where is this going through? So this is now uh, how things are. This is what it's now in America is like this now. Oh, look at that. I'm not logged in in my account. And now let's see. Uh, the the website in America, look, is located in, uh, not in Russia. No, no, no. This is in America. Only in America. Opens up in front of me. Blogger, Google. And... Uh, I get to see the website. Ladies and gentlemen, it took me a while to get here, but it was all worth it, I'm sure, because this is some kind of, I suppose, entertainment website or something like this is what they believe in Russia. Yeah. Okay. So there you go. Something I couldn't do earlier, and I just want to take a note of it. And the next thing I want to do um, I am going to dare to go back to the Microsoft Edge and we'll uh, continue to use this to write down our times. This is the website to access one and using a Google Amerikanski Americanski search engine. This is a uh, Sergey Brin and uh, Larry Page. They were uh, became two partners, very good close friends uh, here in this house. Also, money friends next to Putin. They all uh, decided how the internet will function. What you enter, what will be de erased. They already erased everything about Romanovs, what happened. Uh, so don't worry about it. They are completely rearranging the whole history of the humankind, according to negotiations. It wasn't about the Ukraine only, how they're going to operate. Uh, but it was also a request of British royals, Romanovs from London, Saxe, Cabra, Gotha, Windsors, uh, that... They had their own vision. They wanted to portray themselves in the world as victims. Yeah, oh. Uh, and they negotiate those issues too. And so look at this. I don't get to see my website anywhere. Oh, but there is, a, there is just, a, again, this is Facebook shit. Look at, it's everything deleted, all the images from the internet that pertains to my blog. Well, how about if I go to the Yahoo? Uh, owners also participate in all this stuff. This is wonderful about this world of these royals is they made invitations to all these people that are running the show, basically. And through participations in their show, uh, you too could become a scam of corruption, of criminality, which really have nothing to do with the facts. It's got more to do with like Adolf Hitler rhetoric, which was in fact used sometimes in the World War II to burn books from the Jews. I would say this is to burn evidence about the genocide against me. But, folks, this is to burn, delete, rearrange entire evidence from the history of humankind according to their taste, to their personal taste. If you mattered, you could just enter my room, you could just enter this house and negotiate issues that matter to you for your benefit against the facts inside of that room with the people that around the internet who would have to participate to this type of interrogation, brainwash, wipeout of the evidence right in front of American politicians, of British royals, and so, so they, the job would be completely fulfilled. Or if it was something acquired from their end, uh, from Russia, uh, literally in front of the Russian uh, politicians and so on. And th th they all came to certain things that they're going to run the world according to their needs 
will have nothing to do really with the facts. Uh, if people only knew what the Romanovs were doing to the Russian people before the Russian people stormed on them, what kind of exploitation that was, beginning with the children, with the stuff what went on, how they drink blood, what they were doing with the people in Russia during the Tsarist regime in Russia, what the hell went on. People don't do the stuff atrocities like this. Uh, people, people, I'm telling you this from, from the experience, uh, from my own family. My father was a prisoner in Russia, uh, but in all times here in Slovenia, which never was part of Russia, is far away from Russia. People, you know, you in America don't know about this stuff. People did not even have for the shoes. People didn't sometimes, what they would do is they would take cloth and they would wrap that around their feet and they would use that instead of shoes. If you only knew what the fuck went on with these Romanovs, bloodsuckers, in a Russian uh, tsardom, you never will because they went literally after the school books, even I was taught, to rearrange and arrange history according to their needs. No, I'm not advocating uh, a violence, uh, especially not against the children and so on, but these people, these people are indifferent from those today in London. It, it became evident from my own case. They were completely indifferent. Uh, this here is Yahoo search engine, and at my surprise here, I don't get to see anymore even at the Yahoo. Uh, I did something uh, to already alert about this stuff here. Uh, this is an old from 2016 blog that no longer is valid, and I have to take one down. I have to take one off. Um, Totally blog designed the way they wanted one to look like. But if I go to images, I can still access here uh, links from the pictures, from the images which I have posted on the website. Yeah. So you, you still get to see here the address of the blog. You still get to see that. Hey, the telephone is really persistent. It belongs to my mommy. And that will take you to, to the website here. Um, I like that. I am going to end with this demonstration of empowerment, of Illuminati empowerment. Uh, Prince Harry sues British. Uh, six challenge denial of request to pay for own UK police protection. So the, the poor Prince Harry is in a crosshairs with the British state because he's got to take care of his own security. Not allowed to pay for the police protection. Uh, and I am going to end with the James Bond from today, which have already provided us with a main headline, uh, and that's a chase, basically he's chasing, chasing himself like in a movie, you know, like with the paparazzos driving the car, I don't know, where is it, is it New York, is it Los Angeles, you know, and he's like going back and forth, like, like you know, old, it's Sheriff that returned to the United States of America, just watch out Americans that he doesn't fuck you. And thus, what his granny tried to do, take the Constitution away, kick you on the ass, remind you basically of some other times that you already, you, America, already have faced. Thanks for watching this video. Here is the time and date. The big, big, yeah. I could, we could already call this because I'm taking this from the Google. We could already, uh, uh, we time and yet, we could already refer to this stuff already. Uh, Larry and Sergey, 
Okay. Thank you for watching this video till next time.